Hello everyone, welcome to Garsing Hill, welcome to Malaysia. I'm a local and I want to show you the attractive places in Malaysia that is worth for you to visit. Today is a Sunday morning. I'm going to Bukit Garsing Forest Reserve, which is the green lung situated between Kuala Lumpur and Pataling Jaya. It has become the haven of hikers and nature lovers. Garsing Hill has multiple entrances. Today I'm going in from the main entrance located in uh, Pataling Jaya with a simple archway. There are multiple trails inside the park. After walking about two to three hundred meters from the starting point, there's a gazebo at the junction. Today I'm hiking to a specific location which is the suspension bridge. There are undoubtedly insufficient signboards and maps at Gassing Hill. So far, I only found two or three maps and a few signboards along the trail. Fortunately, that's not a big jungle, and many trails you eventually join at a certain point. It is quite safe to trek in Gassing Hills, as there's internet access at most of the spots inside the hills. My Google map was working, even though when I walked through the trails with the least hikers towards an Hindu temple once I came. Some of the sections of the trails have steps, but you still require a certain level of fitness to climb. I followed the signboard, turned to the left, and that's where the climb started. It's not that difficult to walk because there are steps. But some hikers prefer to walk along the track besides the steps because it is more challenging for them. It's a steep climb and eventually it will lead you to a junction. I took the trail behind this vantage point which will lead me to the suspension bridge. The pavement will eventually turn into nature's pathway. Here you will be greeted by different trails. These trails will join at specific points in front as they are relatively close to each other. According to the map, I'm about halfway to the suspension bridge, which has took me half an hour of slow hiking. You bump into people who like nature. Most of the topics I overheard are about nature, travel, health, and occasionally business related. Every Saturday and Sunday morning, Garsing Hill is packed with hikers who are strolling along the jungle track with the dog and city dwellers who are looking for a real recharge and listen to the nature's rhyme after a hectic week. There are benches at specific points for you to take a rest if you are tired. Garsing Hill is an excellent place for family outings and activities. At the same time, appreciating the beauty of nature. There are some small blue color signs, which have been added by some previous hikers. If you are unsure, just follow these blue signs and they will lead you to the suspension bridge. Finally, I have reached the suspension bridge. There are signs at both sides of the bridge. It says, Attention! Please ensure there is a 5 meters between you and the other person on the bridge. It's quite narrow and only allows one person to pass through. Some hikers prefer not to use the bridge, but instead going down below cross the small stream which is more challenging. Morning. Good morning. 
Where is it leading to? Ah, uh, this one is actually one circle. Oh, one circle. Go, go back to the bridge. Yes. I see, I see. Thank so you very much. Not the bridge. The bridge is that side. Yeah. Going back to the road leading to the bridge. Ah, okay, uh, okay. Uh, Thank you. People are courteous and polite over here. So we are exchanging numerous good morning, thank you, welcome greetings. After I cross the bridge, there's a steep climb to a peak. There are lots of people resting at the peak after the steep climb. From here, you can explore further or take the other trail Going back somewhere not far away from where I start to cross the bridge. There's another entrance to the park about 50 meters from the bridge. I decided to leave the park from here which will lead me to the tarmac road. But if you have more time, you can hike back by following the original trail back to where you came from or explore further then going back by using another trail. As you know, all the trails inside the parks are all interconnected. Thanks for watching this video. And don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel, Travel with My Lands. I'll definitely make more video when I visit some beautiful places in Malaysia in the future. And I'll see you again soon. Bye bye.